Hello everyone, F1 Bobby here and I'm here to talk about the rumours about this year's Call of Duty which is allegedly being developed by Sledgehammer Games. Now, as you can see, I think it will most likely be Advanced Warfare 2 or World War 3. And recently, two very reliable leakers of Kami 13 and the Modern War Zone have they have apparently all but confirmed that Sledgehammer is developing it. And they are both quite reliable leakers. Anyways, I'm going to talk more about it. So if it is Advanced Warfare 2, how would it fit in with Warzone and all that? Because this is a big problem, I, I think. With Call of Duty, the Warzone implementation. Unless it's a new IP by Sledgehammer and it's near future to futuristic. This is why I think it might be World War 3 yet. And then, you, you see. And by the way, if I stutter, that's because I've got autism. And Tourette's and OCD. So anyways... Tom Anderson, uh, another reliable COD leaker, said that the World War Three rumour isn't true, simply saying no to it. And trust me, I'm not really a very good leaker. The only leak I ever got right was way back in 2016, and it related to a minor infinite warfare character called Carl Hamilton. And that was the only leak I ever got right. I really want this game to be Advanced Warfare 2, but how would they continue the story? Kevin Spacey is a controversial figure. And also, not just that, but they said that the war against Atlas continues on. His character's dead, though, at least, so that's one thing. I just wonder what it could be. I mean, it might be World War Three. The current rumour about World War Three says that it's set in set between a war between Korea and Russia, and that it would be a constant war between them both, and it would be a 2030s, 2040s World War Three. So it'll be set in the near future. I don't know how true that is, though, because, like I said, Tom Anderson said no to it. Anyways, I I want Advanced Warfare 2 because I absolutely loved Infinite Warfare. I loved the original Advanced Warfare. The only problem with the original Advanced Warfare is skill-based matchmaking. And also, I worry about the implementation of Warzone because I don't like how there are modern warfare operators and black ops operators in both. Really worrying when they do that. But I must admit that I hope that this year's game is a near future futuristic. Hopefully near future as Blackout was near future. But who knows? Anyways, that's all from me. Goodbye.